Sport and Australia, it's synonymous. Growing up, I always had a ball, board or bat in hand. I loved the team element, playing for one another. But I craved the solace and freedom of surfing. The ocean is my sacred ground. It's where I feel most connected and centred. But I had to fight for my place among the waves. At age eight, I vowed to be world champion. And at 26, I delivered on that promise. Yes, I've finally done it. It's taken eight years. At the top, I felt elation, relief, pure satisfaction. I'd go on to lift that trophy six more times. The podium became my platform, fighting for recognition and equality. It's a battle fought time and time again. Iconic role models around the world, they deserve to get equal prize money. In tennis, I saw Yvonne Goulagong forge her own path. So a crown changes hands. Wimbledon has a new women's champion. And Cathy, she broke more than just records. Cathy hanging on, yes, she's done it. She broke barriers. She's but for many, the road remained unpaved. This sporting nation hasn't always had a podium for its champions. Nevertheless, they persisted. An elite brigade fighting for their arenas. For the opening goal, and there's a piece of history. The tide has turned. 86,174 piled into the MCG today. The peak is within reach. A magical moment in Australian sport has been achieved. For a new generation, the path is now clear. Are you kidding? She'll score! Great tackle. Oh, Zahara Tamara. She'll run away and score. These champions stand tall in a league of their own. Some have been here before, but all have dreamt of this moment. Welcome to the NRLW Grand Final. Welcome to our podium.